vibe yet, so I'm just trying to keep y'all entertained. chatting downstairs. Are you excited? I'm really excited about this event. I love, love, love. This is my second favorite thing to do, unveil new products. You know what my first favorite thing to do is? My first favorite thing to do is thank you tour stuff. So if you haven't um, been part of a thank you tour or watched a thank you tour on Facebook, they are so much fun. I'm going to be doing another one in January. I'm not going to tell you where. Actually, I'm doing two in January. Oh. All right, time to get back on track. Why am I here today? Why are you here today? You're here to see what's new, right? So I have a couple new things to show you. The first thing to show you isn't something that I did or that I'm revealing or that I'm selling or whatever. It is something amazing. Welcome back, amazing scrapbook magazines. I have to give a little sh shout out to Lois Lynn who posted up that she was finally going to get rid of her old magazines. And Lois, look what's new. If you haven't seen Creative Scrapbooker Magazine, used to be called Canadian Scrapbooker Magazine, you need to check it out. Whether you go online and subscribe, and Karen's going to put a subscribe link in the post um, right now about this event. Um, I don't get any kickback if you subscribe. But it's a great magazine, and it's beautifully done. And the ladies, Katharina and Jackie, who put it together, they just do an amazing job. And, ta-da! Right here in the middle, the Get Organized Crafter. Now, all y'all already know this information that's in my first article because it's sort of a um, basics of organization. But every quarter, I'm going to be writing an article about organization in Creative Scrapbooker. Again, most of you will already know what I have to say. But besides me, there's great people in here like uh, Allison Orthner, who does amazing work with Bible journaling. She's also a really talented photographer, so she does uh, tips and tricks article every quarter about photography and how to improve your photography. Kelly Clapstein is in here. She's doing lettering. If you're unfamiliar with Kelly, she makes hand lettering so simple and so beautiful. So. Um, and it's just a beautiful publication. It's done on like thick, nice paper. It smells good, <sighs> right? You are going to love having it. And I'm going to work out a way for Creative Scrapbooker Magazine to help you organize and reference the articles that are in the magazine every month. I just thought of that idea as we were prepping for this presentation. So anyway, Creative Scrapbooker Magazine, check me out. Check out everybody else. You are going to love it. All right. What's new? Oh, I'm going to start with something small but mighty. Who is this? This is Leanne. She is our newest buddy bag. She is 12 and 3 quarter inches long. She's 4 and a half wide, and she's 4 and 3 quarter inches tall. And she has three flaps. She opens a little differently than some of the other buddy bags. And when you look inside, you can see that her tray is not clear. And the reason the tray is not clear is because we needed um, material in there that was a little more beefy, a little more hearty, because you can really load Leanne up with a ton of stuff. So Leanne was given birth because you all were saying, I need somewhere that I can dump sort of my long skinny things or big bulky things that are going to take up an entire buddy bag. I need a place to put those. So that's what gave birth to Leanne. So you can see in here, I've got my um, big punch handle from uh, Fun Stamper's Journey. I've got hammers, brayers, my uh, hot glue gun holder, my heat tool, big scissors, rulers, and even long paint brushes are going to fit in there. Leanne also has a handle at the end, so when you drop her into your tote, she's easy to pull out and, and get what you need. So she's perfect for tools, kind of a tool accessory. But look what else is perfect in Leanne. Okay, you stamp junkies, you can fit a ton of ink pads in Leanne. You can store her flat if your ink pads are going this way. You can store her tall like the... Um, and the bag if your ink pads are going this way. So you can keep them flat when you're storing them, travel easily with those ink pads in your tote. And I've got, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. I've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, four, six. Catherine Pooler, Stephanie Bernard, Color Box, Quick Quotes, Powder Puff Inks, Magnetic, um, Close to My Heart, Stampin' Up. I've got all of those in here. And just like the um, Quick Quotes, I think I could probably get, let's see, 12, 24, 36. Uh, maybe a 42 of them in one bag. So if you have a lot of little ink pads and you want to consolidate them down, you're probably going to love the Leanne bag. Right? It's perfect. What else can you do with the Leanne bag? Oh! You can put the Leanne bag in your new, I feel like um, Vanna White, in your new Laura tote. So the Laura comes in four colors, right? Let me tell you a little bit about Laura, if you haven't seen her. Well, this is Laura 2.0, so she's a little different than the last Laura. So we introduced Laura as a special item about two years ago, and every, ever since she's been in and gone, everybody said, can I please get a Laura, can I please get a Laura? So here she is back, new and improved, the Laura 2.0. You'll notice at the top, she has a clear lid and a double zipper. So Laura was designed to be sort of the ultimate shopping cropping tote, right? So she's, let's, co let's close her up for a minute. She fits along your side thin and narrow. So if you're at a crafting event and you're doing some shopping, she's got reinforced sides and bottom. So if you are getting toll by toll paper or something that's delicate, you've got a little bit of protection in there as well as this nice strap with a shoulder, uh, with a little shoulder pad. On the outside, she, on this side, she's got a pocket that closes with hook and loop Velcro. So again, great for big flat things. Easily will fit 12 by 12 items in there. There's a big band right here on the back so that if you are going to carry Laura on your rolling tote, and it doesn't matter how big the handle is because the entire back is strapped, you can drop her right onto your tote and, and roll away with her attached to the tote. And then on the front, we've got another open pocket. It's not really open. It has hook and loop fabric all the way across. It's very sticky. But again, it's going to fit 12 by 12 items in there. Um, but, well, let me show you, because I have one loaded up. Oh. So here we go with loaded Laura. And so this is the reason we have the Velcro or the hook and loop fabric across the top. So no matter what you're putting in that pocket, you can close it down around that. Whether you're carrying a bunch of rulers or some long paint brushes or a cutting... Um, a paper trimmer, it's all going to fit in there easily, right? And then lock down with that Velcro. So easy to carry, loads up really nicely with what? Oh, your buddy bags, of course. So Laura is going to fill top to bottom. There's some other bags in here. Easy to, whoop, easy to pull in, easy to, put, easy to put in, easy to pull out. And then the other buddy bags as well, you've got the little handle at the top. So when you drop them in, they're easy to pull out. The label on the top, so this is my uh, templates and rulers bag. It's labeled, I can see exactly what's in there. Pull it out quickly and easily. So the Laura 2.0 comes in black, turquoise, pink, and purple just like all of our other bags. So it's a perfect cropping and shopping tote. You're gonna love it. You are totally gonna love it. Everyone's loved it in the past. That's why Laura came back. Okay, let's talk about the ultimate cropping and shopping bundle though, because we have for a limited time, and I'm gonna tell you, uh, just a little spoiler alert, the cropping and shopping bundle is gonna be available on HSN on January 8th. I do not know what the price point on it is going to be um, on January 8th, but I know that it is going to be on January 8th. So what's in the cropping and shopping bundle? These have things in them. I wanted to, there we go. What is in there? What are you going to get? Inside the cropping and shopping bundle, you're going to find all of these goodies. Another spoiler alert, if you're watching this presentation today, 
wait until tomorrow to get your crop and in shop and bundle on our website because tomorrow is the last day of our 12 days of Christmas celebration and the crop and shop and bundle the Laura tote and the Leanne bag are all going to be available on special tomorrow December 12th okay so what do you get you get the Laura bag and then you get six buddy bags so you get brandy you get Leanne you get Shelly Gail Edna now if you're unfamiliar with the buddy bags they all have a variety of purposes so I'll show you some loaded up as well just at the end if you haven't seen them before you also get Deborah and she's uh, for pens and markers and everything tucks right in there if you want to take it all with you to to an event but you also get in the bundle the six by six paper handler the eight and a half by eleven paper handler which also fits a four paper and magazines and you get a 12 by 12 paper handler now if you don't have all the buddy bags in there you can easily put any one of the paper handlers into your Laura bag now the 12 by 12 obviously is the biggest one so you're gonna get the least other stuff in but if you some people use these for project planning and they have all the pieces of a project but if you slide that in, you can still get the Brandy in or Edna and Shelly, a couple of bags in with it. You can also put any one of the other ones, so especially card makers who are using 12 by 12, that's going to slide in. And then you'll also be able to get a variety of bags, of buddy bags in around the middle one. And then, of course, the smaller one's even smaller. So once you put that in, you still have room for a lot of buddy bags. This is a great way to sample and try all of the paper handlers in all three sizes and also get a collection of buddy bags that is really super versatile and going to work for so many things. Let's, let's talk about the individual buddy bags and what they fit, what will fit in them. First one is Leanne. And Leanne is going to fit all kinds of things. She's our newest one, as you know. Um, so I have her loaded with ink pads here. But Leanne also is great for bigger tools and bulkier stuff. You're going to get Shelly, and Shelly is ideal for washi tape. She also works great for things like memento inks, the small teardrop-shaped inks. All the buddy bags have a photo gallery on our website, so you can look at each one and know all the different things that fit in there and how many of each thing will fit in there. The Edna buddy bag is ideal for ribbon, and she's also perfect for Tim Holtz Distress Inks. You can just stack them up in a tower, keep them nice and flat, see all of them, and I know you can get 18 or 19 of those into one um, Edna bag. The Gale bag is kind of a catch-all bag, so I guess better from this side. I've got adhesive runners, pop dots, photo corners, and then liquid glue in this one. But just really easy, this type of this bag, to just pop open, set on your work surface, especially if you're at an event, and be able to pull those things in and out quickly and easily that you want to work with, right, without making a mess all over your table. So that's Gale. You get Gale. And then you get Brandy, and Brandy is a long, thin girl, and she, I've got her loaded with rulers, with edging, um, with the border tools. Even, she's even a great place if you use Kiwi Lane border templates. The Kiwi Lane border templates also fit in Brandy. She's a nice, tall girl, so she'll hold all of those for you. And then last but not least, you get our super popular Deborah marker bag. So perfect for Copic, Zig, um, Co uh, Spectrum Noir, Colorista, any of that size length of markers are going to fit perfectly in the Deborah Buddy Bag. So with the Ultimate Bundle, again, I just want to remind you, tomorrow the Ultimate Bundle is going to be on special on our website, and it will be available on HSN on January 8th. Again, I don't know what the price, what price Joanne's going to have on the 8th. Um, you get the Laura Bag, choose from four colors. You get six buddy bags, Gail, Edna, Deborah, Leanne, Shelly, and who am I forgetting? Brandy. And then you get one of each of our paper handlers, the six by six, 
the 8 half by 11 slash A4, and the 12 by 12 paper handler. And those all come together packed in your tote with the bundle. The Laura bag is also available separately. So if you, if you have ton plenty of bunny bags and you just need a Laura bag for shopping and cropping, you can buy the Laura bag as well um, on its own, again, on special tomorrow. And then the Leanne buddy bag included with the bundle, but also you can buy it also available on its own on our website as well. This item will be on special tomorrow too. So take advantage of our last day of our 12 days of Christmas. Um, and get the things you need to get organized for 2019. <sighs> Thanks so much for popping in today, seeing what we have that's new, hearing about tomorrow's specials. Um, don't forget to check out Creative Scrapbook or Magazine. You are gonna, I mean, the quality of this magazine is just, it's amazing. You are gonna love it. Um, you can ask questions in our Facebook group or email us, customer service at totally-tiffany.com, and we're happy to answer questions for you. And I think that's it. Have a wonderful holiday season. Thanks so much for stopping by today, and I look forward to seeing all of you in the 2019 Get Organized Challenge, which starts January 22nd.